You are welcome to another video of the course F5 Big IP DNS. In this section, we are going to implement again DNS Express, but this time with F5 local bind service as a primary authoritative DNS server. In the previous section, we have implemented DNS Express, but with Microsoft DNS server as the primary authoritative DNS server. In the first step, I set up a local F5 bind DNS service by creating a new zone, raika-code.bind, using zone runner utility as we have seen in the previous sections, in the section uh, zone runner, and then zone lease. We create a new zone in the external view, the default view, and with the name of raika-code.bind, which is the name of the zone and uh, the name of the name server and also a start of authority server is ns1.raika-code.bind both name server and the start of authority with the ttl 300 seconds and with ip address 192.168.1.181 which is the management ip address of f5 device and create a record yes and finish a new zone is created raika-code.bind in the f5 local bind service and you can query this zone without creating any listener as we have tested in the previous section then we add the local bind name server to the list of name servers in the section delivery name server name server list and then create bind or f5 underline local underline bind name underline server with the ip address 127.001 which points to the f5 device itself and then finish now we configure the list of IP addresses that are allowed to copy the zone information in name the or bind configuration file in the section zone runner and name the configuration here allow transfer we configure the list of IP addresses that are allowed to copy the zone information to their database as a secondary name server this option can also be configured through CLI command var name d config and name d dot com this is exactly the same configuration by default there is allow transfer option which is local host by default and this is enough for us since the local f5 device received the zone information through the dns express feature and we will see in a few minutes we also enable zone change notification message to be sent to the local host by adding another option with the name of also dash notify with the option one port 5353 this means we enable notification when there is a change in the zone configuration there is a new record or a record is deleted from local bind service then uh, the local bind service notify the secondary dns servers which is also here the local f5 device to request again the zone information to be updated so allow transfer local host and also notify must be configure 53 53 in the name the configuration and then update please note that if you change the bind configuration file via cli you will need to manually restart name the service but if the changes are configured via gui this happens automatically in the background uh, when the changes are through the cli in name the.com and then you have to use big a start restart name the service and 
ZRD service. These two services must be restarted if you change the bind configuration files through the CLR. But through the GUI, as I've said, this will be done automatically. In the next step, we will configure DNS Express, but local bind server as a primary name server that we have just configured. We allow in the section zone and then zone list, we create a new zone with the name of Roika-co.bind with F5 local bind name server as the primary server and we allow notification to be received from the IP address 127.0.0.1 which is local F5 device and we also disable TSIGK verification and then finish to ensure that the zone transfer for zone Raiko-Cobind is performed correctly in the first step we can check inside the GUI when it is available usually it works correctly but you can also check through the var log ltm file with command tail dash f var log ltm make it bigger and then here you see the message transfer of the zone raika dash code dot point with serial number successfully is done that means it works correctly we can also check the dns express database for the raika dash code dot bind zone using dns x dump command as we have seen in the previous section dns x dump for the zone raika dash code dot bind we see that the records are replicated from the local bind dns server to the dns express database and to ensure that zone change notification also works properly we add a new entry in the local zone to see if it is replicated to dns express or not in the section zone runner we create a new record with create and with the type of a record and host one dot raiko dash code dot point with ttl 300 seconds and ip address for example 20 30 40 and 50 without reverse record to be created since the ip address is it's just an example and then finish we check again slash var slash log ltm log file to make sure if the notify message is sent from local bind dns server to the dns express or not again with tail dash f var slash log ltm we see handling notify from zone raika dash co dot bind that means that the notify message is sent and then we expect that DNS Express database also is updated with command DNS X dump for the zone Raika dash code dot point. Uh, usually it takes a few minutes to be updated. You see that it is updated Raika host one Raika dash code dot point. The other method to, to verify the operation of DNS Express with local DNS point is to create a listener and we query then the listener the profile which dns express is activated we have discussed about in the previous section and then we query uh, the listener to uh, give us the information of the zone with nslookup or d command i will not repeat it here again because we have talked about it and implemented in the previous sections